Hello everyone. Today I'm here to show you some quick ways to notify your team after uploading a file to your SharePoint document library. I'll talk about five ways through which you can do it. You may be familiar with some of them, but I'm sure you might not have noticed some of these options. I'm Alex Joseph from Doc365. Let's get started. I'm on my SharePoint start page right here. And I'm choosing the site marketing updates to perform this tutorial video. So this is my site marketing updates. We are using this for updating marketing related uh, details, documents or activities. So let's go to the document library of this site. So this is the document library section over here. So what I'm do, going to do is uh, I will be showing you how to upload documents and how to notify your team about these newly uploaded documents right away. So I will show five ways to do that and you can decide which one is easiest, which one is most suitable for your requirements. So let's first upload a document here. I will be choosing any random images so that I can show you how to do that. So let me upload this image first. So I have chosen the file. So this is how you can upload a file quickly. You can also drag and drop documents into this um, document library over here. So all you need is to just click on the upload option here and choose the file from your desktop. So once you have completed the uploading process, you will see a notification, a confirmation message like this here. So here it says, the .jpg file is now available. It means the upload is complete. From here, you will also see another option here, which is notify your team. This is provided here to let you notify your team about this newly uploaded file instantly. So all you need is to just click on this option, notify your team option. You can either choose any of the groups here related to this site, or you can always choose a person. So I'm choosing a person here. So I'm choosing Adesh. He's one of the members in this team, in this site. So one uh, limitation about this option is that you can only choose uh, groups or people who are part of this SharePoint site or who have permission to view documents in this uh, document library. And this option will be seen only uh, when you are uploading a file for the first time. So once you miss this uh, confirmation message here, you will not see this option again. So after choosing the user, whom you wish to share a file or notify them about this upload, click on notify. So this link will be sent to that person through email and they will receive the notification. This is one way to uh, let your team know about a newly uploaded document. Another way is that uh, you can directly choose any of the files. So let me choose any of the file here. So this is the file I'm choosing. Just choose this file and click on the share option from the top. Here you can share this file with anyone in your organization. So you can choose anyone. Just click on, just enter the name or email ID, anything regarding a person and you can choose the person you can also enter a message here regarding the document if you wish to provide any instructions or more description about 
or this document you can include it here and uh, the next thing is you can decide what kind of permission they have whether they can edit or they can just view this file there are also link settings you can add so that's uh, all about these options there is also a, a copy link option provider here and after making your choices you can click on send so a mail will be sent to that particular person with the link to that document and also the message you uh, entered so that's the second option and the third option is the copy link option so uh, this there was a similar option in the previous uh, technique or method too so this is how you can get the link to this particular document so once you click the copy link option this link will be automatically copied to your clipboard you can click on copy if you want to copy again you can use this link in uh, email uh, text conversations or you can place it in anywhere so that uh, people can easily find your document uh, there's also an option to decide the link settings or the permissions here so you can decide who would you like this link to work for so you can choose any of these options you can also decide whether they you wish them to um, edit the file or not so that's the option there is also a option to block download or whether to decide um, if you wish to allow the user to download the file so that's how the copy link works that's another way to notify your users and the next method is to the fourth method is to pin the document to the top this is actually not a uh, instant notification but uh, this one is uh, about highlighting highlighting this document in your document library so if you wish to highlight this document you just select the document and click on pin to top so this file will be presented at the top of the document library so anyone who is visiting the document library will see this document first you can always uh, remove this document whenever required for that just uh, click on the ellipsis and choose edit pin and unpin so that it will be uh, moved there is a fifth way you can uh, notify a new lead um, uploaded document and that is by creating a power automate flow you can also use a power automate flows to get notified when a new document is uh, uploaded to any particular document library you wish so you can track the activities in that uh, document libraries there are i think there are uh, more than one templates a power automate flow templates provided to uh, get that on you can even get a notification automatic notification to your um, microsoft teams channel regarding the document upload in that case uh, we have done a blog regarding that and uh, if you're interested you can check it out i will put the um, blog post link in the video description below so uh, that's all about this video uh, hope you got some good information from this uh, tutorial uh, try these techniques and make it easier to let your team know about new document uploads easily uh, we'll see you with another video soon. Have a nice day.